We launched the awards to simply celebrate uh, our centenary and find a way to engage with uh, young businesses, entrepreneurs that might be starting out on their own journey. 2021, it's our centenary, that's pretty remarkable. And what I love most about it is the fact that actually what we're, we're doing within the centenary piece is looking forward, not just back. It'd be very easy for you to do a, a flash party, but that's not what Monch Games is about. Monch Games is a partnership, it's about collaboration, it's about working together as a team. And actually doing something like this to invest in young entrepreneurs and people that want to start up their own business is a great way to give back to an industry that we've been very successful in. We're obviously always looking for opportunities for, for new business for ourselves, but this is actually looking to invest in um, other companies that will hopefully be able to change the property sector as working at the moment. Our mission is to improve diversity, inclusion and equality throughout the real estate industry. We support black professionals, those who have qualified, have been working for a few years but are struggling to break through that proverbial glass ceiling to kind of get to that mid to senior levels. There are so many individuals out there who they feel maybe alone. If you are a black professional in a small company and you're not seeing yourself represented um, sort of in the higher senior levels, you might feel that you know there's no point in you really continuing. But when you have a potential organisation or initiative that you can plug into that can give you that support and mentorship, it's just invaluable. What really impressed me about Faith actually is she's come through um, the industry and qualifications of qualified chartered surveyor and then alongside that normal job wanted to give back. I think that's massively important. She has a plan of what she's trying to do. I think there's a lot of work that's done around early careers, so like graduate schemes, internship schemes, apprenticeship schemes. But actually, the more senior up you go within the industry, the less representation there is. And I think that she'll be able to make you know, a positive change in the industry. We have a major diversity problem um, within the industry. And what We Rising can do around that is, I think, is potentially quite revolutionary, providing kind of really grassroots, ground up support. So really excited about it. Hybers' mission is to reform student renting by building relationships around care and trust. Moving out with your friends for the first time is gaining independence. That should be something to look forward to. And if you think about Airbnb, like it's renting a house to go on holiday. Everyone gets really excited, you love the experience on the website. So why couldn't it be the same thing for student accommodation? In the market, you have traditional letting agents that are a very expensive option for landlords and they historically have a very toxic relationship with students. The other side of the market, you have the disruptors. So you have open rent and right move. So we offer prices that are more comparable to open rents, but with more add-on services and a very personalised experience for the landlord. And for the student, we just tailored our solution to the student market and we really hold the student's hands, make sure that they know what their obligations are and make sure that they're supported throughout their, their rental journey. I really quite like the idea of the, the caring side. It's not just a, a fee generative sort of agency brokerage between students and landlords. I really like the extra add-on around uh, well-being. There's elements that they're building into their business now where you know, people from less wealthy backgrounds that don't have the ability to have guarantors you know, and they don't have good credit because of kind of school, that they have a program that helps those people also get into the type of accommodation that, that, that wealthier students might be able to do. So um, that really appealed to me. I think probably two things made Hybus stand out. You would have met Hannah, uh, she's a very engaging individual, she's really articulate, but also they're having spotted that opportunity and being bold enough to make something of it and actually spend some time investing in this to get to where they are today. It's really clear that she's very passionate about her business, um, she's she's built it from, from scratch, uh, but I think there's so much more that, you know, with the help of Monch Gavins, that we can really maybe push her on to the next level. Montague Evans are a huge real estate consultancy firm and given that the black professionals that I was helping were from the real estate industry, it just made sense. I was looking for opportunities, grants, competitions and I couldn't believe my luck when I came across this one because this is prop tech, this is the property real estate world. It was just a great experience to really pitch in front of people that understood my industry and could ask me interesting questions because they actually understand my model. To be honest, I was not expecting to win. Because we're so new and starting up, I just thought there'd probably be other more established businesses, but we won and we're here. I was ecstatic. It was great because it was been a really kind of been a really busy couple of months at Hyber. We've got 14 people in the wider team, a lot of people work part-time. So to tell everyone that, you know, we've won this competition, we're gonna get all the support, it was a good morale boost for everyone on the team. Every now and then you do need a bit of a pat on the back and just someone telling you, you know, you're doing something right. So it was hugely beneficial to me. 
I'm really enthusiastic and I think the, the whole business and certainly the whole partner group are really enthusiastic about all being involved. It's really good to um, be a part of something that's going to bring about change. To be able to be part of something that hopefully I see the benefits of in my time will be really good. I don't have a board at, um, at this moment in time, so it's really valuable just to have someone to act like as a sounding, a sounding board. I definitely have big plans for Hyber, and I'm excited to kind of sit down with um, my mentors um, from Montague Evans and, and really talk about the next um, few months and few years. Having people that are experts in those fields, it's just great to have them on board and it gives you that sense of comfort to know that, you know, I might not have the answer, but I'm connected to a group of people that, you know, between us, we can come up with the answer. We've chosen two firms who are looking to change the future of the property sector. Their values align with ours and we want to be part of that change. The campaign sets up for 100 years of further growth of Montague Evans and I think it's part of showing that we're evolving and changing too, recognising some of the challenges in the industry and looking to do something about them.